Children will encounter strangers all throughout their lives. It is very important to help them know how to identify safe strangers and keep them and keep themselves out of harm's way. By teaching about stranger danger, today our students will act out a role play on stranger danger concept. We are the students of reception D and B. Everybody used to call her Little Red Riding Hood. Darling! Yes, Mummy? You know your grandmother is ill. Would you take her the cookies I baked and the fresh herbs I picked from the woods? Of course, Mummy, I will. Do not leave the road in the bunny forest, sweetheart, said her mother. As she was leaving, Little Red Riding Hood started walking in the forest while joyously singing songs. She did not realize that she was drifting away from her path. Suddenly, a big bad wolf approached in front of her. Where are you heading, little girl? To my grandmother's house. I'll head on first and let your grandmother know that you're on your way. The wolf took a shortcut and quickly made it to the grandmother's house. He knocked on the door. The grandmother yelled from inside. Who is it? The wolf changing his voice. It's me, Grandma. Little Red Riding Hood. The door is open, my dear. You can come in. The wolf smirked and stormed in through the open door. When a while later, Little Red Riding Hood arrived at the grandmother's house. Little Red Riding Hood knocked on the door. Her grandmother yelled from inside. Who is it? Um, it's me, Grandma. Little Red Riding Hood. The door is open, my darling. You can come in. Little Red Riding Hood hesitated for a moment. The wolf dressed in Grandmother's clothing, with her nightcap and her glasses, was lying in the bed. Come, my darling. Come closer. Why are your arms so long, Grandma? So that I can hug you better. Hmm, why are your ears so big? So that I can hear you better. But why are your eyes so huge? So that I can see you better. Hmm, why are your teeth so sharp, Grandmother? So that I can eat you better. <laughs> At that moment, Little Red Riding Hood realized that it wasn't her grandmother lying in the bed, but instead, the big bad wolf she had ran into along Help! the way. Help! Help me! The hunter heard Little Red Riding Hood scream and ran straight to the house, stormed into the open door and caught the wolf immediately. I finally got you, big bad wolf. Now you're in my hands. Thank you for saving us, Mr. Hunter. You're welcome, but promise me, little girl, that you will never forget what your mother asks of you. Mm-hmm. So, friends, we learned that stranger is danger, and we should always obey our elders. Now we are going to show you what little daddy hood should have done when she met a stranger.
a hairy wolf And she starts to say hello Hello She starts to say hello Who are you going to see, Red Riding Hood? I'm going to see my granny And where does your granny live, Red Riding Hood? Along the path in the woods Would you like to walk with me, Red Riding Hood? No thanks, she said Bye. 